And new at 11, a freak accident almost kills a Marion County man. He was impaled in a car accident during rainy weather. Now the community is stepping up to get results for him as he recovers. News 6's Eric Sandoval spoke with the family about the upcoming rally that will help pay for his recovery. The car Dalton Marsh was in hydroplaned off this road, sending it right into a fence that's now covered in brush. You see that fence post there? One just like it impaled him. And tonight, he and his family say it's a miracle he survived. And I looked down, and the first thing I saw was a board sticking out of my chest. Marsh says he soon realized the fence post was sticking out of two sides of his chest. And he says he didn't think he was going to make it. I was thinking of what I had left said to my mom. I told her that we were riding to town and going back thinking that I didn't talk to my dad before I left. Just thought that pretty much that was the end of everything. He had reached out his hand to me and said, Dad, hold my hand. And I got a hold of his hand, and I can't explain the feeling that I had. Doctors at Shands Hospital in Gainesville saved Marsh's life, removing the fence post and stapling his chest shut. Tonight he's back home with his family, not able to work because he doesn't have full movement of his right arm, and he has medical bills. His sister decided to have a yard sale to raise money, but as more people in the community heard about what happened to him, the event grew and grew. Now, two churches are putting on a cowboy church benefit with raffles and a DJ, with all of the proceeds going to Dalton, or Boogie, as he's known to his friends. It just don't feel like it's strong enough to just say thank you. Going to be a road of recovery, but very blessed to still be walking around and alive. The fundraiser for Marsh is set for this weekend. We've put a link to all the information on our website. ClickOrlando.com. In Marion County, Eric Sandoval, News 6.